Grant, Vince, and he said it just felt so good to see the checker flag fall, and he'd be right there in touch with the leaders after the rough start that they got off to a lot of confidence for this young man. Let's listen to this. Wide open, coming to the green. Will he go off the road? Certainly does. A lot of gas there. Still not able to get in touch with Corey Heim. That tells you what a super lap that was. That's for sure. It's one of those laps when you come on the radio and say, that's all I had, boys. Boy, he never got out of the gas, and it's still about a tenth and a half slower than Corey Heim. Well, that's a great sign for this. Right yep. And Zane Smith and his crew chief, Chris Lawson, will take that. That's for sure. They were really excited about this truck and uh, bringing it here this weekend. Yeah, As you we said, see Ty Majeski. You said you talked to him about the truck, yep. and he said we've really done some R&D and think we've got something that's better than what we had. Yep. So we'll see if that comes to fruition tonight in the race. Certainly looked good in qualifying sitting P2. And Majeski was second quick in that practice session earlier this afternoon or this morning, I guess. He's tracking second in this yep. session. Oh, lost it right there at the checker. Nope. Nearly lost it. Yeah. So as good as that Zane Smith lap was, Majeski betters it by 3 1,000 at an 825. Is that about an inch or two, Vince? It can't be much more than that. <laughs> Here's Carson, Carson Hosevar, back-to-back runner-up finishes. Six drivers have gotten their first career wins here at Kansas through the years. Is Hosevar got to be a prime candidate to add his name to that list? 100%. He's just nipping away at him. Very close. really committed on this lap. Great job by the young man. They're down in 15th. We heard that concern when we yep. interviewed him earlier about, you know, where's the speed? That's when your crew chief says that we're going to race well tonight. <laughs> Here's the last of the bunch. John Hunter Nemechek. Can he knock his teammate Corey Heim off pole position? Nemechek last week at Darlington won the pole, led the most laps, and won the race. He only won the pole at Darlington by about four tenths, Vince. <laughs> he nipped him. He nipped him. <laughs> He's stocking a tenth or so on him right now. Can he keep it down? Loses a little bit off turn four, but that's the pole. He did it. John Hunter Nemechek, third pole this season. The only driver with multiple yeah, poles. Nice job, guys. He's 24 years old. Seems like he's been around forever, but he is not even 25 years old yet. That, that's incredible. You know, you think of the youth in the truck series and our champion, Ben Rhodes, at 25. I guess if you wanted to play who's older, I would have guessed John Hunter is more, but that just tells you how much experience and what all he's accomplished at such a young age.